Hi, I'm Stephanie. And I'm Carly, and today we're going to be making cookies. So, let me lead you through the process. I'm going to find my cookies. Oh man, that's messy. Should be back there somewhere. Oh, just keep digging. There you go. Got the cookies. Now we're going to go to the kitchen and we're going to make our cookies. <laughs> What else do I need? Butter, eggs, cooking utensils, um, you know, the good stuff. <laughs> so I'm going to get in my fridge and I'm going to get the butter and I'm going to get the eggs. Uh, here's the butter, eggs. Um, Alright, I think that's all that we're going to need from in here. Now I need my other utensils. Nope, not in there. Nope, not in there. Oh, baking sheet. <laughs> and <laughs> <that's what we got. laughs> Cookie sheet. Um, and I'm going to need some flour, sugar, I mean. And I'm going to get the vegetable oil. We're going to need that. And then I need a bowl to mix all these in. So let me find that really quick. Nope. Uh, nope. Oh, bowl. This one looks good enough. Okay, and we're going to mix that in here. And then I'm need to preheat the oven to, hmm, looks like, uh, 375. All right, and we'll wait for that to warm up, and while that's warming up, we'll mix our ingredients. Take two. This time, I'm going to take you through the process of making cookies. So, here, in our pantry, we don't need to come here anymore because we've moved all of our food from our pantry <laughs> to the kitchen. So, let's go to the kitchen. Um, so, here in the kitchen, I'm going to start by getting out my cookie mix and reading what it needs. Alright, we need some vegetable oil some sugar. That's it for this cabinet. Um, then we're also going to need our baking sheet, bowls and measuring cups. Our bowl and measuring cup. Our baking sheet. And we're going to need butter and eggs. Those were easy to find. And I'm going to preheat the oven to 375. And now, we, while we wait for our oven to heat up, I will mix the cookies. Okay, so as we can see from the first video to the second video, um, there's a huge time change there. It was about a little bit over a minute um, just by changing the location of our ingredients. So we moved our ingredients from the pantry to a couple cabinets next to each other in order to cut off some time from our process. And during that time, we learned that the process control was important for improvement because then we weren't spending as much time walking back and forth from the pantry and we also weren't spending a lot of time looking for things. Um, we were able to shave off a little bit over a minute of our time there. Process, Process improvement, improvement tastes good! good.